Now at noon, we just got our first named storm of the hurricane season, Tropical Storm Alberto, forming in the Gulf of Mexico. The storm threatening popular Texas vacation spots. Dark clouds and gusts of wind rolled into Galveston yesterday afternoon. The danger of strong currents are marked by these red flags and no swim signs. Some beachgoers ignored those warnings, though, but with the waves this high and potentially dangerous storm approaching, it was only safe to go waist deep. The National Hurricane Center issued a tropical storm warning that stretches across nearly the entirety of the state's coastline. But right now we're turning to a live look at the Gulf Coast as winds begin to kick up even more. This is a look at the tide from the Seagull condos in Port Aransas. You can see the surf really picking up, barely any beach there at all. Let's get right to meteorologist Paul Morales who's tracking it. Paul, how much rain should we expect to see here in San Antonio? Well, here in San Antonio, I think anywhere from around about an inch and a quarter to maybe up to two inches of rainfall. And some of it will be tropical downpour, so it should rain heavy at times. And I think the rain intensity will pick up later this afternoon into tonight and then tomorrow it'll be more sporadic. But this is what I think as far as the rain totals are concerned. Now this is just one computer model. It says all the way through Saturday morning about an inch and a quarter, but I think anywhere from one to two inches is probably more like it. But you'll notice down to the south much heavier rainfall for some of our southern counties. That's why there is a flash flood watch. We're not included here in Bear County, but uh, from Gonzales to Eagle Pass and then southward. Also notice that there are some uh, tropical storm warnings in effect for some of the coastal sections. Let me show you what's going on. Rain is approaching San Antonio. Rain is, rain is approaching from the east to the west. Most of it is going to be moderate to light. Every once in a while, there will be a heavier tropical downpour. And you'll notice here down to the South. Speaking of Port Aransas, there's now a tornado warning for Aransas County, and that's until, oh, for about another 10 minutes or so. Also, there's a flash flood warning that does include Aransas and also Corpus Christi, so getting pretty rough down to the south. By the way, Alberto looking more of a tropical storm, has a better structure to it. We're a long way away, but this is a broad system. I'm going to talk more about tropical storm Alberto, what that means for us, and where Alberto is headed. That's all coming up in just a few minutes.